Nina come up, Michael Lublin come up, please come up, thank you. Good afternoon everybody. You know that's a really tough act to follow. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we're here to say thank you to Susanna and, and all of the, the team that, that does this every year. Also, uh, of course, the 21st is the anniversary of uh, uh, the International Day of Peace. And um, I think that's something that everybody is concerned with on many levels. But one of the challenges in, in this world is that as individuals, we really must establish and build healthy families. And healthy families need to make healthy communities. And a healthy nation is based on healthy communities. And a world is based on healthy nations. If our nations are in need, then the world will be the place in which those needs are ambassadors for peace and should be wherever we are, whether with our neighbors, living for the sake of others is really our mantra. We have to find a way to live for the sake of others. And in that, our own individual needs are oftentimes taken care of. Oftentimes we focus on ourselves and we want to be taken care of. But actually, if we live for the sake of others, then our, our own self will be really much more fulfilled. Do I hear an amen? All right. So I'd like to just introduce a couple of people who will be... It's because of God. And we try to understand what are all nations and all people looking for. And what they're looking for is for happiness. That's, the, that's what everybody's looking for. The happiness again is achieved, like Reverend Brother said, living for the sake of others. You're significant. Each person here is the power of one. You are the power of one, and you can each bring major transformative change. So again, it's a pleasure um, to be here and to acknowledge the newly appointed ambassadors for peace. I wanted to invite to stage somebody named Supolo for outstanding achievement, for doing all of the set designs, for working for peace, and having been for so many years with us. And then we have a special honor from uh, the UN that I met, uh, Reverend Moody, who has his own church, and he has an airplane that's a hospital for rescue for other people. We will have a plane, uh, but our vision is to blend healing, physical healing, with the greater need of relational healing, the greater cancer in the world that's malignant, is relational, and that needs to be worked on and mended and healed. Thank you very much.
like to have George say a blessing for all of us who are present. Please, George, come and bless for us uh, the stage and channel something wonderful. Thank you. Um, just wanted to say one sentence. We just have to uh, all work on uh, becoming peaceful ourselves when we think of world peace. So we don't need to start from us, we all know it, but to act it is a different thing. So uh, I wish all of us to have a peaceful existence every day, every moment, every breath. Well, thank you. This beautiful tail feather is from the young child, Mr. Peacenik. And the first tail feather went to Paris Lapkis at Good News Broadcast, all the wonderful things he does. And this tail feather is for Susanna Vasilica, my dear friend, who has been with me forever. And this is from the Paris for Peace. Oh, we thank you.